Good morning. This is Pastor Tim Wells, pastor of Cross of Christ Lutheran Church in Aurora, Nebraska. We've had a fair number of members in our congregation who have been grieving the losses of loved ones these last three months. Uh, we've had members who've lost parents, grandparents, siblings, friends. Uh, there's been a lot of names in our bulletins uh, at the top of our prayer list. Uh, the top of our prayer list is where we have prayers for those in need of comfort, and it's always family and friends. So here we're talking about people who have died. And we've had a lot of, of people who have lost loved ones. I thought in light of that this morning, and I know I've read this, uh, this chapter multiple times in devotions, but knowing that we have people grieving, I thought I would point us again to our hope. And one of the greatest summaries we have of the hope of resurrection life, we find in Psalm 23. And so I read those words to you now. The Lord is my shepherd, I shall not want. He makes me lie down in green pastures he leads me beside still waters. He restores my soul. He leads me in paths of righteousness for his namesake. Even though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I will fear no evil. For you are with me. Your rod and your staff, they comfort me. You prepare a table before me in the presence of my enemies. You anoint my head with oil, my cup overflows. Surely goodness and mercy shall follow me all the days of my life, and I shall dwell in the house of the Lord forever. As we grieve the loss of loved ones, we remember our good shepherd Jesus. We find comfort in knowing that Jesus was with our loved one throughout their lives, leading them, guiding them, protecting them. And now that they've been laid to rest, we find comfort in knowing that through Jesus, they have gone to dwell in the house of the Lord forever. As we ourselves find ourselves walking through the valley, of the shadow of death, living in a sinful world. We find comfort in knowing that our shepherd leads and guides us, that he's bringing us to the same house where we will be, yes, with our Lord forever, but we will be with all those whom Jesus has brought to the house. We'll be with our loved ones again to live with Jesus forever. Let's pray. Lord God, Heavenly Father, Lord, we come to you today with heavy hearts as we grieve, as we remember those loved ones in our lives whom we have lost. Lord, give us hope. Give us comfort. Give us joy in remembering our Good Shepherd and our Savior, Jesus and the life that he has won for all who belong to him. In your name we pray. Amen. Pray God's blessings on your day. If you're grieving, remember the promises we have in Christ. And if you know someone who's grieving, give them a hug and remind them how much Jesus loves them. Amen.